Welcome back to our channel. Welcome back. Today we have a very different video for you guys today. What are we doing? We are staying home. Because <laughs> we broke. <laughs> you need money to go places. Not, not necessarily. I mean, we can bike, we can do things, but we don't feel like it today. So we're staying home and we are going to continue to prepare for our trip. Yep, so in case, um, for those of you that are new here, we are planning on traveling for a year starting in March of next year. The plan is still to travel next year, but, you know, given everything that's happening right now, we don't really know if that's still going to be the case. But It's going to be the case. We're still, I'm leaving. We're still optimistic <laughs> and we're still sticking to the here. plan that we've put out in motion. So, um, we're still on track. We've been saving a lot of money. We've been paying off all of our debt. So, that's exciting. And I think we just have one big big payment and we should be fully done with paying off all that debt. For our trip, we have decided to try our best to pack carry-on only. That means that we will not be checking any luggage, which is going to be really hard because I need my hair products and I still haven't figured that part out yet. And they are not 3.4 ounces. So one thing that's really important when you are packing carry-on only is to know exactly what clothing items you are going to be bringing with you on your trip because every single piece of space you have in your suitcase is very very important yeah and since our trip is kind of a little ways out we are you know experimenting at this phase we're buying some clothing items and testing them out to see what exactly we you know like wearing and yeah. stuff that's actually comfortable um and also not just being cheap on the items that we buy but buying things that will actually last us a long time and i noticed that one thing that we've been having trouble with is finding lawrence shorts that are long enough for his legs because if you guys haven't noticed or don't know us personally lawrence is six foot two and it's hard to find shorts for legs that are six foot two. Definitely. So today we're going to attempt to actually make some jean shorts out of these old jeans that, that I Diana hate. <laughs> hates so much. And Every actually, time he wears them, I just point, I, I don't even wear the jeans anymore. So we're gonna we're gonna try to salvage these ugly jeans. So all the men in my family are pretty tall. Like my brother's like six four. My uncle six four. My dad six three or six. How tall is my dad? Like 6'2", six 6'3"? Six three. Six three? Yeah. So, and they all have these really nice shorts. I asked every single one of them where they got them from. They all said they made them themselves. All three of them. They all made their own shorts. So today, that's what we're going to try to do. Yep. So you'll you'll get to see our attempt. Hopefully it goes pretty well. Um, if not, we, it'll be a funny story to tell later. <laughs> we got some, some handy tools that... uh. Um, auntie has given us so we're going to utilize those today so to make our shorts we're going to need marker one marker some fancy some fancy cutting tools it has the case on oh. it crazy <laughs> and most importantly ugly jeans they're not that ugly they don't look ugly right now but they're like dad jeans and we don't have kids so he doesn't need to wear dad jeans my grandma also gave us some rulers. Straight edge. So without further ado, let's get to it. Alright, so these scissors aren't working, so we're gonna have to find something else to cut these jeans. So what I was doing was actually cutting the bottom just to make sure, like I could do a little test run, but I've only gone halfway and I don't think this is sharp enough to cut the whole way, so. Never mind, it looks like it's working. I think I was doing it wrong. Got the first piece cut. This is just a test piece. I'm thinking that we might have to make our thing a little lower because why are you why are you like that? Oh. Because this patch 
It's holding together the distress part. Gotcha. Cool. We don't have to. Is it easy? But yeah. And if we need to cut more, I'd rather have it, not need it, than need it, not have it. Yeah. So. I say we make a new line. Right underneath of it. And. We really have no idea what we're doing. So yeah. All right, go ahead. I'm okay. What's the bright neon light? We'll be glowing every night in the sea. Woo! All right, moment of truth. Go put them on. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so. Lawrence just finished cutting them. I told him to go put them on because this is the moment of truth. He did all the cutting because they're his pants and if they're messed up, he can't blame me. <laughs> <laughs> My man got caprice. <laughs> all right, they look, they, look, they look a little bit uneven. Uh, <laughs> look, how, look how much. Look how much. It's not bad, baby. Yeah, it's not terrible. There's a patch behind this little piece right here and we take the patch out if we fold it upwards which we need to do because it's uneven the patch is gonna show take one this one is substantially longer than this <laughs> but at least they're not too short we're gonna try to cut above that patch and just hope that they're not too short. And hope that the GoPro doesn't die. Always to say, keep it up, playing dead. At least that's what you said. Camera lights, that's the game. We did it. So girl, Here's the moment of truth. He has to go put them back on. If only y'all knew how long this really took. Cause it's taking a lot longer than this video actually is. And here he comes. <laughs> okay, back up a little. Yeah, they do. But I definitely think they need to be cuffed. Wait, y'all, do y'all see right here how they go, whoop, whoop, up in the center? Oh, that's straight. Ah, that's funny. Anyway, let's see if I can cuff them and make them look better. So this side is lower than this one? That's how both, yeah, that's how these on both sides. The outside is lower than the inside. Mm. <laughs> Don't be so defeated, honey. It's fine. Just do a cuff. Is that tight or loose? What? It's, cuff. That's pretty loose. Does it make you feel uncomfortable? This one was higher than this one, though. All right. So overall, I think the shorts turned out pretty good. Um, I'm still here, guys. <laughs> just in case you're wondering. It did take a lot longer than expected because the little scissor tools weren't as sharp as they probably used to be since... And the GoPro died. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I think it was a fun experience. Hopefully, these jeans, shorts will last me a long time before we have to make another one. And now we know if we find some really cheap jeans that aren't the, his leg length, but they are his waist length, I mean... You know what I'm trying to say. Yeah. If we find some 32 jeans that are very cheap, we know that we could just buy them and make them shorts ourselves. Mm -hmm. I think, yep. So I'm going to cherish these jeans. A lot of <laughs> blood, sweat, and tears. Oh, went you bled? <laughs> well, yeah. Thanks for watching. Hopefully this was helpful for some of you. Hopefully you found this entertaining. But as always, make sure you like, 
and comment and subscribe and be sure make to make sure you put those push notifications <laughs> on so that you can be notified each time we put out a new video and as always thanks for doing life with us peace that was super <laughs> weird <laughs> we switched roles <laughs>